Uh -huh. Um, yeah, that actually wasn't that funny. But, um, whatever. We will... Since it's one of those cross, um, screws, we'll just add two loop cuts over there. We'll scale along Y. Um, okay. This is probably getting a bit confusing, but it's all right. If we just limit selection to viewed, to to view, um, maybe that will be easier. Now let's extrude along Z. Now it looks like we have a square screw. We do not want that. Camera is interfering with uh, uh, what I'm seeing on the 3D viewport. And I just uh, turn on proportional editing on. And if I scale on Shift X and I make this a bit smaller. Oh my god. Okay, let's, let's try this again. Let's just scale and shift C. Okay. That's looking nice. Press O to turn that off. O is also to turn it on. I think Control O is. Okay, apparently that's save. When we're thinking of that, let's save this so we don't crash. So that would suck so much. You don't even know. Okay, now let's press A and we'll just move that down. I think that's a decent looking screw. Let's uh, shade smooth. Maybe a one more subsurf. All right, now we are looking good. Now, if um, okay, let's try. Okay, we gotta go object transform origin to geometry. Okay, now if we do a mirror modifier, you might be thinking, well, it's just gonna it won't mirror anywhere because it's just there okay if we okay first let's name this name this pick up then what's this we will name this screw and what's this oh that's a fretboard Okay, now let's mirror around pickups along X and Y. So now they're right there. Now, that's pretty awesome because now I don't have to shift D, duplicate it, and then shift D, duplicate it, and it's just saves this time. And now, if I want to edit it, which I do, because uh, I just do. I'll select these. And I also want to uh, select these. If we Turn that off. Okay, yeah, that's, that's easier. Uh, 
Okay, there we go. And turn some surf back on. Edge crease. And let's turn that off. Scale along X. Scale along scale along Y. Now it looks a bit more like a screw. I'm gonna turn the render up to three. Okay. Yeah, now it's starting to look a bit better, I think. Um it definitely looks like a guitar now. Uh but there's still uh there's still four still more eight screws that we have to do, but they're they're a different type of screw. So this type of screw is pretty much the same thing, but okay, what we'll do, you will shift D along Y and delete that mirror and edit. And we will delete those faces. Okay, wait. Okay, to do, do scale along Z down to zero. Press A, move that down. Um, link, delete faces, hopefully you are catching all of this, extrude along Z, scale in just for that little bit of, um, I don't even know um, what it's called. Okay. Um, let me just look at my guitar one more time. Okay, um, Okay, now we were going to collapse that and we were going to add a mirror. We were going to mirror around screw on Y. And we, yeah, okay. Now we are going to add another mirror. We are going to mirror this one around pickups. And that. All right. Now we got a whole bunch of screws. And actually, this is just why I love mirror modifiers. Because you can edit this and everything else follows it. Because it, it's, just, it's just how a mirror modifier works. But I really do wish I could zoom in more. That is a bug blender must fix. Don't 
want that one selected. Don't want that one selected. I don't want that one selected. Cats. I think that is good. It's just jumping all around here. What the hell? Okay, there we go. Now we'll scale them. And actually, I actually want that smaller. Okay, yeah. Now I am done with the screws. And um, I think I'm done with this part of the tutorial right here. Um, yeah, I'll end it right here. And have a nice day. I'm going to say that.